It's like sharp inside. I'm not kidding. Dude, awesome. I haven't even gotten a storage unit yet. <laughs> Look at it. I literally just looked over here. It was on top of the grill. So Turbo like, Graphics Mini was just sitting there? Look at that quality too right there. That is just as quality as it gets right there. Dear Lord, help us. Wow. Man. Oh, dude, look at this. Oh. How cool is that? Ship. Dude. Um. Um. What? Well, today's the day. It's a big day, actually. It's a day that the community has been asking us about. A while back, we went to a storage unit and got one of the most unbelievable hauls we've ever gotten. We got tons of super rare video games and super rare toys, and the community noticed, and we were supposed to come back for a part two, but things got in the way and we never ended up going back, and some stuff that we can't really say publicly happened, but now we're back, and it's the day. Let's get into this. It's gonna be wild. I'm ready to dig today. Yo, I am so ready to dig. So excited. I can't believe part two is here. I think this is going to be a long one for us. I, I honestly think we'll be here for like five, six hours doing all this. That was, that's a, it's a huge story. We man. have to get to the rest of it. So it begins. Pulled some stuff out. Tri's already pulling some stuff out. Check it out. NBA Jam sealed. All sealed. Wow. The Genesis seal is such a funky Thank you. Are those all what NBA Jams? NBA Jam, Batman Forever, Batman Forever, Batman Forever. Wow, so three of each. What in the world? These are shockingly clean. Hot spots, super jam power-ups. Ooh, secret characters. I mean, if you're gonna get a sports game on the Genesis, you're, a, you're good with NBA Jam TE. Possibly one of the possible best there is in sports. What just happened, Ricky? Nom 1975. Yo, Nom 1975. That's and it's spy hunter. Dude, feel feel the weight on this okay, thing. Okay, let though. me see. Ready? Wow, that's actually <laughs> shocking. Holy cow! Open it up. See if it's all. Actually, it might be kind of hard to open up. We're both juggling uh, packages. Oh, shoot, look at how nice that is. Oh yeah. yeah, it's in there. Well, I almost feel like I never see manuals for this. Dude, awesome. Haven't even gotten a storage unit yet. That makes us happy, Try. That's a smiling moment right there. <laughs> so after an unbelievable start, I mean, unbelievable, it couldn't have happened better before we're even in the storage unit. Now it's time to actually head to the storage unit. Some good memories were had in here last time. <laughs> I'm ready for more. Oh yeah. Ricky's over here stretching. He knows what's coming. Go oh, ahead, Ricky. Exactly what's coming. Stretch it out, out, Some out. This stuff was heavy last time. Oh yeah. It was really heavy. Welcome to the, Welcome to the abyss. Welcome to your doom. Welcome to your well, Black Adam. I mean, I know. Yeah, here we go. I mean, it's again just starting, but this is this is how it begins. And this time, Ricky, we grab everything. Yes, yes, sir. This time we grab everything nerdy, Ricky. I love it. Turbo Graphics 16 from NEC, the higher energy video game system. Yo, right off the bat, how did we miss this last time? <laughs> Whatever you guys want, just the go ahead, okay? I literally just looked over here, it was on top of the grill. Turbo like, Graphics Mini was just sitting there? It was there. What the heck, how we missed it? All right, here we go, you grab that. No, no, you know why? Because yesterday I brought a guy here, so he, he, like, I, I told him- Oh, he was looking through it. I look for a small box with the Genesis game. So we kind of move some stuff around. Oh, oh nice. Was, you know. Let's go. All right, Ricky, you uh, start the stuff over on that Let's side. Start. Last time we didn't get these. Like a bunch of dorks. Last time we passed up on a bunch of stuff. You know, I think we were not like, it's, it's like sure how much we were getting. So we're like, maybe we shouldn't take that. Shouldn't take this. I don't know. But now we're like, let's just take everything that's left. By the way, these are like such great display items right here. So we got that and some more Black Adam stuff, which I'm not a Black Adam guy, but also uh, some Dungeons and Dragons stuff as well. So Ooh. in the buy pile. So there's a few uh, TVs like this, and we're trying to get a bunch of these. There's more here, look, Ricky. We're trying to get more because for SoCal Gaming Expo, SoCalGamingExpo.com, you need to come to it. Oh, we need more TVs for our free play area. So always good to grab more of these. So it's kind of cool. There's a whole bunch right in there. This, this is shockingly heavy, Ricky. Oh, I know. What the heck? They don't make them like they used to. Super Console X Pro. Is this for the Super Nintendo? I could use myself oh, a little. That is the one that has like all those, uh... Preloaded retro game. Oh, it's like a little like mod box. Here you go, Ricky. Let's take that. Okay. Let's get that. And then Ricky, over here, I can spot from a mile away. Again, we're gonna take all this. Oh, look at this, guys. Look at this. Hello. How did we miss some of this last time? Batman and Robin, big old Batman. Let's go. Oh, we didn't grab this last time. I 
freaking idiot, you guys. Like, freaking idiots. I will say idiots. Idiots, idiots that we didn't get this last time. Idiots. I'll say it. I'll admit. Idiot. What do we got? Ooh, Game Gears. I think it's just the bag. Oh, the other. Yes. I was wow. missing this sound one wave? last time. Yeah, that is sound, sound wave. wave. That'll complete the others. Wow. Command. Oh, dude, look at this. Oh. How cool is that? Ship. Dude. Um. Um. What? I've never seen him in the box. No way. So I gotta point this out. This was a much bigger deal than Ricky and I even knew. So we discovered this after the video. I'm talking on the way home. This is actually a replica. This is made by a different company. You can call it bootleg, a replica, whatever you want. But we found out they're extremely valuable and they sell at extremely high prices as well. I will just say this. We sent a picture to some of our friends on the way home and it was sold before we even made it home. Okay, this is the coolest thing I've seen so far in here. Cooler than this? Okay, maybe not cooler than that. Wait, no, I don't know. Wait, oh, dude, it's wait, moving! Sh wait, go again. I don't even know Come what I Come on, Chucky. Speak to us! Cry Ray. me. Hi, I'm Chucky. Wanna play? The first thing we gotta do is get me out of this body once and for all. Yo! <laughs> look at, look, look, look! What else is in there? Right at 13? Ooh, oh, Ricky, what's oh, that? What is this? Okay. No way. The this Castle cool. Gray Skull Ring. WWE Ring. Is that vintage? I it's gotta be. I don't think so. I think it's. Uh, it looks old. Yeah. It looks old, but I think. 2019. 2019. There you go. Wow, that's awesome, dude. And what's that? Oh, yes, another Transformer. And Transmorphers. I get the most excited over the Transformers. Oh, there you go. Girl. Oh, that's cool, yep. dude. Oh, yeah. Okay. There we go. I am. This, to me, is the coolest thing. Uh-oh. What is it? This is a sponsored segment of the video, but you do, do not, if you skip, you're gonna miss one of the things I've been most excited about in my entire gaming career. I'm not joking. Ask any of my friends. This is for Mr. Mr. Add-ons. When Mr. Add-ons reached out, I wasn't too familiar, but I've never, Ben, Ben. Ben knows how excited I've been. Dude, Aaron has been going bonkers. I, I, I have, I truly have. Okay, so why don't we explain first to the people. Yes. Ben, and the reason I'm having Ben explain is truthfully, Ben is much more knowledgeable than I am on this stuff, way more. I love the games and I'll explain to you in a little bit how my experiences with the gameplay and all this stuff. But as far as what Mr. Add-ons is, Ben is the guy to understand. Because funny enough, when I sent it to you, he immediately sent me back I have this product. He's like, this is the premium. Oh, I'm gonna stop talking. What is Mr. Add-ons? What does this do? Okay, so Mr. Add-ons utilizes FPGA technology to play retro games. So it's similar to emulation, but you could say that it's a more accurate representation of the original stuff. So it just ends up looking a lot better. There's less tinkering to do to get it to work and it's just a great experience. And, and you can buy it in the kit, which is how I got it, looking just beautiful. It doesn't look like some, you know, and what's inside of this, I mean, we have, oh, it was, it's gone now. <laughs> we, we had an example. I put it away. Ben had his, which has no shell on it. Correct. You can get it either way. I got it with the kit, which is beautiful. Now I will say, for myself personally, as soon as we got games on there, I was immediately freaking out because I've never been super like techie or good at being techie. But as soon as I saw how the games looked, I was like, I've always been jealous of like game sack and my life in gaming and all these people who have like picture perfect quality. I was like, this is it. I finally arrived at that point. Yeah, cause you could go through the hassle of HDMI modding all of your old retro consoles, but like, each one of those mods is gonna cost you $100. And so that's what the Mr. Add-ons does for you. It gives you that true original experience. Yeah, it just looks way more beautiful on the TV and it's a much more uh, better representation than like software emulation. Yeah, so you don't really have to be a whiz at computers to understand how to get this going. You know, you just kinda, you know, I happen to be in IT, so I, I know about uh, moving files around. And in a nutshell, that's kinda what you really just have to do. It is so freaking nice to me. Finally, like everything looks the way I've always been jealous on YouTube is not the brightest guy with this stuff. Seeing people load this stuff, I look, uh, there's some fun <laughs> ones on here. Ben made an adult section, by the way. <laughs> 
you know, peekaboo poker, all those games, they exist. But I think, let, let's, let's go to probably one of my most games that I understand and I know exactly how it should look, how it should play. Chippendales Rescue Rangers. I mean, there we just, go. I am playing on an OLED too, so I will say the blacks are as black as it gets. The colors is pixel perfect beauty. I have to point out that N64 has been working flawlessly. Now we are gonna get a different controller for it because we yep. have to buy a different controller ahead of time. But as far as all the games, everything we've tested, not a problem. Yeah, we haven't hit a bump at all. N64, which was said to be difficult to emulate, yeah. it's rocking on the mister. <laughs> I don't have a way to screen record. You're gonna have to go with my word. I am telling you, this is the best way to play retro video games ever. It's gorgeous, I, guys. And Ben is the guy to know. I mean, that looks so stupid, stupid, ridiculous clean. The, the blues, the colors, the vibrance is amazing. We're gonna talk more about this in other videos coming up. They have been awesome. Mr. Add-ons is also a big fan of the show. That's how they reached out. It wasn't a typical sponsor where they're like, oh, hey, uh, will you do this and say this exact line? He was like, I don't care what you say. We love Pixel Game Squad. We love Pixel Podcast. Go down to the link down below in the description. This is like the one time in my life where I'll say this is like the most perfect for our show sponsor we've ever had. I'm telling you, you will not regret it. I promise you. There is no, this is my promise. You will not regret these if you get one. I'm telling you, Mr. Add-ons. Thank you guys. We'll talk to you guys in another video about it again. Back to the video. Uh-oh. What is it? Ricky's hollering at me All still. Right, so I love it. It's newer, but I love this. But that is actually awesome. A blood sport <laughs> shirt. But look, look at all the masks. Trick oh, dude, treat. that's cool. Yo. Ooh, the trick or treat ones. Trick or treat has such a cool like mask style. Look at this. Dude. That's actually like insanely rad. What? Uh, Mike Myers. Mike Myers. Let's go. What else? Hellboy. Hellboy. Wow. More trick or treat. Oh, Try. Trick -or -treat. What's up with all the masks, bro? Did you collect these? Did you collect them? Yeah, and they're all brand new like that. Wow, try that's awesome. Buzz out the whole box. No, yeah. No, that, that's nothing. There's probably uh, at least another four or five hundred of them in there in the back. What? what? He says there's like maybe four or five hundred more of those. If more. In the back. If more. If there. more. So those are all full of masks. There's more, man. That, that's nothing, man. <laughs> Look at our pile already. That's nothing. This is a great pile. Look at this. But hiding underneath the couch. <laughs> Silver Pikachu. Just that that's that's what so that's what today is. And Ricky and I look over here. Look at already, you guys haven't noticed, but look at this. Already, this is all the stuff that we're digging through each bag, each box, not just like looking, but like piece by piece by piece. So it's gonna be Ricky, here you go. Kong, and oh. then also, this is really cool. Look at this boba. No, this thing is sick. No, look at this boba though. Baby, baby. Whoa. Ricky, so this is just full of loose toys. I actually have to move it over. This. Yeah, that place was uh, get ready to become the second Frankenstein. That is awesome, Ricky. I mean, look at it. It's just Rick Grimes, Superman, Ghost Rider. There's some good toys though. They're just all loose figures though, but they're, uh, there's a good amount here. Ooh. So, so any, uh, Scorpion. Oh. There you go. Oh. Nice. There you go. Oh, look at that venom. Oh, Freddy's missing his head. Capitated Freddy. Look at, look at that venom though. It's like coming out. That's awesome actually. So we're in here hunting right now and this is getting wild. I mean, you guys don't get to see how much we're really doing. We are pulling out just hundreds of boxes, which obviously I'm not gonna film because it makes my job more difficult of going through each thing, but we are finding so much stuff, so many toys. And then moments later, we find like a loose toy and then we find the box for it. And with the box is worth so much more money or hold so much cool value as my childhood is a piece that I loved or a piece that Ricky loved. So this is just becoming one of those days where it's long, it's grueling, but I wouldn't change it for anything. Whoo! I have to take a, a little breather over here. We're probably like an hour and a half deep of, of hunting right now, of digging. Yeah. But back in. Why don't you say go on your video and uh, just make my day if I can watch it and say, hey, you see this knife? I got it from that was, Yes, Try just gave me a knife. Look at here you go. I got myself a bloody knife, which I'll be using in videos and can frame Try with if I murder somebody. You know what you should do it? What? Do it. Do it! Oh, let's go! Good one, Ricky. <laughs> oh, and then he found this. Vegeta. Let's go. Super Saiyan. What else is in here? Oh Zelda yeah. What the? Oh, WWF motorcycle. Zip cord motorcycle. Yo. Oh, okay. Undertaker that's... and Kane. That's dope. 
<laughs> just pulled these out of this box. I just keep finding stuff like in boxes. Like I'm telling you, like ran, oh, I just dropped in there. Like random boxes that feel like junk boxes. Just keep having cool vintage stuff. I like these Dragon Ball Evolution ones. There's a few of them here. God, I keep dropping stuff. I'm the worst filmer ever. I know Dragon Ball Evolution wasn't, didn't do well, but sometimes that stuff's really cool. Also this, look, it's from uh, Assassin's Creed. I think this is a, a Halloween, you know, old prop knife. So keep digging. I was literally just like throwing a backpack. Like, get, I literally was shoving it in the thing. Like, get out of here. And I turn it around. I'm like, oh. Oh, like, this is like a, this is like a good build one. This one feels nice, dude. Yo, that's clean. In the pile. Thank you, Ricardo. Oh, do it again. Let me open this thruster. Ah! <laughs> oh, and also while he's doing that, I mean, look, a bunch of. So Tri was in. Oh, this is Assassin's Creed. A lot of like prop swords. This, actually, almost all of this is Assassin's Creed. There's more Assassin's Creed right there. There's uh, some double swords. There's a, a Rick, a walking dead machete. Is this uh, Michonne's then? Isn't she the machete girl? Rick's machete. Oh, it is Rick's machete though. It says it right there. Hey Rick, it's your machete. Nice. Let's see this box. Just literally, you guys have no idea how much effort it's taking me to get back there right now, but this says masks on it. So let's see if that's an accurate statement. It is. It. Oh, wow, Pennywise really? too. What else we got in here? Let's see. That is awesome, dude. That Yo, is that, Those eyes are like gnarly. They look real almost. Seriously. Man, that is beautiful, dude. What else do we have? Oh my gosh, we have so... So he is really, really into like horror mask collecting. Yeah, oh look! Aha! Doriman. Ooh. Right there. A nice old one, maybe? Looks like it. Okay, so we'll have to um grab what's... In oh, oh, Ricky's gonna like this. Oh, that is good. It's from the movie. There you go. There you go, dude. Thanks, Ricky. Uh, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I pitted them against each other, but not until they set aside their differences did I see the true power they all shared deep inside. Oh, oh I got you. Hello. 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 There's games. There's games. Oh, this is a good one, actually. Is the game in here, though? Come on, in here. Dang it. Not in there. You want a fortune teller? Wow, Dreamcast, Dreamcast, let's go. Dreamcast? Oh, what is this? Might be like one of those homebrew ones. Ghost Blade on Dreamcast? Let's go, it's in there. Okay, I'm having high hopes. Oh, I'm stuck. I'm quite literally stuck. <laughs> I'm just stuck right there. Figurine collection. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. I'm gonna pull this out and see. It's it's still sealed, so let's let's just pray this is what we say they think it is. Let's go. Let's use the knife Chai just gave me. Alright, here we go. Let's see, is it figurines? Oh! Yes! Tis my oh, gosh, dude. that scared me to death. This was just peering through the box and genuinely was worrying me as we were opening it. Oh, name the game, name the game. Who's this guy from? Oh, uh, Fish and North Star. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, do you want to know the funny thing? What? I just was playing that last night on NES. No way. I was showing my, my son literally last night Fish and North Star on NES. That's actually awesome. Dude, again, not being a, the biggest pop guy, but look at the ones he got. Awesome. Friday the 13th, Freddy Krueger. Oh my, I'm like scared. More Fish of the North Star. <sighs> Oh, he'll, he'll show up. Oh, more fist than our star. Oh, more fist than our star. Yo. Ooh. Oh, yes, from the ride. <laughs> that is so cool. Okay, this box is like, I feel like layers deep. That's probably one of their arms right there that I just pulled off. Ooh, cell. So, yeah, a lot of themes, like I said, like what Tri has, he'll have like boxes. And then on the other side, they'll be like the toys somewhere else and then empty boxes here. So, Yo. let's see, Ricky. Oh, upon further inspection. Uh, please take there. That's real. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's awesome. All plushies, but look. That is so cool. Oh, dude. Yo, yo, yo. Huge, detailed, and beautiful. That wow. Is... Look at that quality, too, right there. That is just as quality as it gets right there. Oh. Oh, guy. Lifting stuff at an angle. 
not easy. Ricky, I'm going down gently. It's not smart. It's just awkward. Oh, Lord. Oh. Well, at least it was off. I can tell you what it is, so it's not that great. You got it? Yep. Oh, cool. More, more masks. Now, this one's cool. So, this is actually probably one of my favorite ones. So, if you've watched a Halloween 3... This is the one where it would come on the TV, the Halloween mask. Not scary. Hold it still, Ricky, because I'm going to insert myself into the, t the movie. Yo, the son of Chucky one. This is a weird one, dude. That's a bizarre one. You actually watch the movie on this. It's actually like, there's a lot of weird stuff in the movie. But then again, that's most uh, horror movies in general. But wow, dude, look at this. Oh, Hell dude. Hellraiser. Hellraiser. Dude. Like, Loki hurts inside. Oh, ow. Dude, it's like sharp inside. I'm not kidding. How are you supposed to wear that I thing? don't know. Oh, here we go. This is a good one. I can see it looks good. Chucky, no. Nice Pennywise. Oh, it's the new Pennywise, too. Oh, uh, well, I'm Pennywise the dancing clown. None of these are like boo-boo. They're all like good ones. Dude, Pennywise had a cool punk band. <laughs> he did. I love Pennywise. Did you know I did? Fun fact for the audience. Bring. I tried out for a band and my audition was singing uh, Pennywise music. That's how I auditioned for the band. Ooh. Did I get the part? Yes. Did I end up doing any shows? No. Hey, so. what was your, what was your, uh, how'd you, what'd you do? Hey, Georgie. <laughs> no. <laughs> I just get this box. <laughs> box that says figures. Oh my gosh, that's actually heavy. I mean, I'm not the strongest guy in the world, but that is. Okay, I'm putting myself to this. Riff, smile, you're on camera, look strong. If your children will watch this one day. Failure. Okay, here we go. Now, it could be not, but... Oh, yeah, we're good. Look at this. Ready? Yep, let me see. Awesome! That's cool. That's cool. Oh, a mini. Look at that. A lot of, like, random electronics, but there's also a mini just sitting right... Mini snus. Here. I play my mini so much, dude, at my house. Like, that's like my number one console. Um, yeah, I'll have to dig through a lot of this. Oh, that's... Ooh, the Django fit. together, that's cool. That's awesome. Dude, I love Star Trek. Um, <laughs> dude, I freaking love Predator. Ooh, dude, you know what I really like? What? This one. Oh, dude. My just lit up right now. My face did light up. Wow, dude. I freaking love G.I. Joe. <laughs> Actually, awesome. A gargantuan alien battle fortress has penetrated our atmosphere. Robotech. With the advanced technology of the SDF-1, you can defend against the Zen party warriors. Look at Wait, is there some? This feels heavy. Oh, Vita. And a cleany weeny to top it. Welcome back to another episode of Blake's Games. I'm delusional. I've lost all sense of reality. So after digging like wild men and being extremely exhausted, but totally worth it, we're now putting everything back. We're trying to place everything back even better than we took it out. That's something we kind of wanted to do is to make sure we're putting it back nice, kind of clearing him some boxes, making room for him so he can get through here easier next time. So after this is done, we're kind of going to go over what we got. Well, this is everything and it's... Dear Lord, help us because we are not the best with like a lot of figures and toys. So there's gonna be a lot of scratching our heads the next few weeks. This is uh... keeping what we want, keeping what we want, or picking what we want, what we want to sell. It's gonna be a lot of work. We're gonna hire somebody. We have to. We have to. I mean, literally gonna have to hire somebody. These are all. I mean, you. Can, I mean, it's hard to see like what's in these, but these are all full. This is all like all like Yu-Gi-Oh and Magic cards and scream masks and there uh, don't get us wrong there's a ton in here but again ricky and i not being the most proficient with toys like finding where this ichuki sasuki is is it's in here we just don't we don't know where we don't know so we got a lot a lot a lot of work ahead of us my goodness and to be honest we paid a price more to help try yeah more to we help paid. Them. We paid up. Yeah. Probably more than we're comfortable with, to be honest. Yeah, a lot more. <laughs> I'd say a lot more than but we're it, comfortable with. It, it helps out. Right? It helps him out. That's kind of why yeah. we're low-key doing this, so yeah. without getting into details. Getting uh, this stuff to Ricky's car. 
is uh, pretty brutal. It, there's a lot of big boxes. When you got big boxes of toys, that stuff, it's not like video games where you just slide in some carts. No, this is big old bundles of boxes of delicious toys. Here's my load, doing everything it can. Look at this, just box. This ain't all gonna fit in Ricky's car. There's no way. This just never ends. <laughs> Low-key a little embarrassed right now driving down the street, but we got to do what we got to do to get this over. Ricky, you feeling good about everything we bought or is it a little overwhelming? It's a little overwhelming, but I'm, I'm excited to go through it because we didn't we didn't even see half of it. No, we really we didn't. We just grabbed boxes like, all right, we'll take this. Yeah, and right now we're currently at, at Waba Grill about to get some food. Well, to chime in kind of a few days later is it's really taken Ricky and I about two to three days of full days just to kind of organize this stuff. There's more than I can even show in these videos. I just took a little bit of shots kind of while we were at the tail end of moving things around and kind of organizing. So was it worth it yeah there was some really good stuff in here and it was totally fun to do and we love the dig more than the actual stuff all the time anyway was it the best financial move i don't know maybe not necessarily but it isn't one that i would regret in any way shape or form some of the best stuff we've found in a long time this whole storage unit going back to part one if you missed it you gotta watch it it's just been such an amazing journey and to be honest we kind of did it this second time around just to help out a friend in need. So thank you guys so much for being here. We really appreciate it. Thank you more than we can ever say. Ricky, say bye. Get ready, you want bye.